I want to take this opportunity to speak to our brothers, the Taliban. We call on you to ensure the safe and secure passage of any individual in Afghanistan out of the country. We call on you to immediately stop the violence, the genocide, the femicide, the destruction of infrastructure, including heritage buildings. We call on you to return immediately to the peacekeeping table, to the peace deal that was negotiated, and to ensure women and minorities' voices are part of that discussion. This is for Minister Monsef. Um, in your statement, you referred to the Taliban as our brothers. Can you clarify your remarks? Is this an indication of the government position positioning softening on the Taliban? Hardly. The Taliban are a terrorist group, and yet they claim to be Muslims. We're calling on them to immediately allow for the safe passage of any individual who is in Afghanistan out of the country. We are calling on them to immediately seize the violence, the femicide, the genocide, the rapes, the lootings, and to return immediately to the peace negotiation table in an inclusive and meaningful way. If they will ever be recognized as a legitimate party, this is the starting point. The reference to brothers is a cultural reference, of course, but let me be very clear. We do not support the Taliban. We are horrified that the hard-won gains of the past 20 years are at stake like this and being eroded like this. We are horrified that our women and men in uniform had to move forward with a difficult operation that was only made more difficult by their actions and deeply disappointed that their threats of ongoing violence have led to the international community, particularly the Americans, saying we're going to leave on the 31st due to these threats of violence. The language used by the Trudeau government is completely unacceptable. I think of the women and girls in Afghanistan are at risk with the Taliban regime once again coming into place. Canadians deserve a government that will always stand up for our values, for our interests, a prime minister who will act in our national interests at home and abroad. We're not going to get that with the Trudeau government. You will get it with the Canadian Conservatives. Uh, the minister has uh, expressed her, uh, her, her views and explained herself. Um, we will continue to uh, recognize that the Taliban represent a terrorist organization uh, and continue to push on them so people can get out to safety.